You are never too young or old to tap into your artistic side, and one local art studio has been sharing its love for art for 19 years. Cultural reporter Brittany Flowers stopped by Cafe Monet to see how they're teaching new art techniques to the community. I wanted to start it just to provide a safe place for people of all ages to tap into their right brain and kind of have a place to um, hang out and create art. Jules Winson. I was artsy growing up, yeah. Is the owner of Cafe Monet, an art studio that opened 19 years ago where you can tap into your artistic side. We don't just do the ceramic painting. We teach clay, watercolor, acrylics. The walls of the studio are filled with options for painting. When you come in, you don't even have to have any experience. We show you how everything works. I decided to paint my favorite animal. I've always wanted to paint a hippo butt purple. <laughs> the Cafe Monet staff helped me think of a way to paint my hippo out of this world. Dab in, like, surround it or, like, cross through it. Just... But Winston's love for art and people expands beyond the walls of the studio. I actually teach in several assisted living facilities, um, like an art therapy program. So let's go ahead and get your lace. Here she is showing a group of women how to make clay bowls using lace cutouts. And then you're going to take your roller. <laughs> oh Look gosh. at that, Tori. Whether you're at an assisted living facility, elementary school, or a 20-something mother of two with nothing better to do on a Tuesday, no, I... painting is hard work. It's always nice to show a little love to your artistic side. I think that being able to be here in the ebb and flow of Austin growing and people are still discovering Cafe Monet and that's to me just the best. Brittany Flowers, KVU News. And Cafe Monet has two locations, one on the south side, the other one off North Lamar. That looked like a lot of fun. I want to paint a hippo. We saw that hippo that uh, Brittany painted. I was laughing at me because I want to paint a hippo. Interesting color choices she made with that. Hey, purple is a beautiful color. Don't knock. Yeah, but his mouth looked kind of weird to me. <laughs> but she's a first timer. You can paint your own hippo. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what a hippo's mouth looks like anyway. So what do I care?